Meat Boy is back and today I'm going to show you guys how to cook a thin or small steak. You know, you're not going to sit down and have this gigantic two inch thick tomahawk every night for dinner. So sometimes something on the thinner side, there's definitely a few tricks you can use to get that perfect steak temperature. So here we have two steaks from Frankie's Free Range Meat, the Bavette steaks, which come two to a package, four ounces each. And we also have the eight ounce ribeye. This isn't actually something that I would consider on the thinner side, although some of you might. This is kind of like average. So you shouldn't really have a hard time cooking something like this, even if it's at room temperature. But uh, these Bavette steaks are definitely on the thinner side. So when we open this up, we have two steaks here that are pretty small, pretty thin. You know, it doesn't really get much thinner than this. So the main thing to keep in mind here is we've had this sitting in the fridge. They are pretty cold. You cannot cook a thin steak from room temperature. You're going to overcook it. So what we're going to do here is a little bit of salt, season it on each side. And we have a clean kitchen towel, just a non-toxic surface that you can dry this with. You don't really want to use paper towels. And we're going to let these steaks sit in the towel with the salt while we heat up our pan. Uh, so I like using these green pans for the quick sear on these steaks because if you have a cast iron or a steel pan, carbon steel, if it gets stuck just a little bit, you don't have a long cook time to let that crust naturally detach. So go with something like this. So after, you know, a minute or two of sitting in this towel, the steaks have a nice dry surface. Then we can put it in the pan. So we want to move this around and flip it pretty frequently with the pan being basically as hot as possible. If the surface of the steak is dry and the pan is really hot and there's oil in it, you're going to get a really nice crust really, really quick. And since we had the steak cold in the fridge, the inside temperature is not going to get cooked that much. So we got a pretty nice crust within, you know, just a few seconds here. So if you're not getting a nice crust, always just add a little bit more oil and you'll basically fry the surface and get that really nice browning. Now, as you can see, there's like an insane amount of smoke coming off this pan. So normally I would, I would put like parchment paper or something to cover this just so I don't completely smoke out my kitchen. So it's simple guys, really hot surface, little bit of oil, have the right pan, dry off the steak. And you know, you have a really, really delicious piece of meat with a perfect crust in just a few minutes. <coughs> oh God, I need a gas mask in here. So we're just going to take this steak out of the pan, let it rest on the cutting board. And this other steak, I actually usually just uh, you know, take it like this, put it on a plate and let it sit in the fridge until I'm ready to cook with it. And that surface will dry out even more and it'll be even easier to get that crust. Right, we're basically in a cloud of smoke over here, but uh, we're going to slice this for you guys just to show you that it's uh, really, really rare in the middle. You know, we were able to get a nice crust without cooking the inside. So you can really take this to whatever temperature you want. Of course, we want to slice against the grain. There you go. Blue rare on the inside. Nice crust on the outside, you know, despite how thin this steak is, you know, even like, even on the edges, you know, where it's thin, it's still really, really nice and rare on the inside. So that's really it guys. Cooking steak doesn't have to be this huge, big thing. You know, you could have a really, really delicious, perfectly cooked piece of meat within just a few minutes for lunch, dinner, whatever time of the day you'd like to have it. So on Frankie's free range meat, we do have these Bavette steaks. We have flat iron steaks. Those are both kind of pretty small and convenient. And we also have a new steak sale going on with like eight ounce ribeye, eight ounce strip steak, as well as some sirloin steaks, which are on the smaller side and perfect portions. If you're looking to have, you know, four ounces to eight ounces of meat per meal. So definitely check out Frankie's free range meat.com. If you want to do something special, you know, you could do butter, thyme, garlic in there, and even take some of our collagen broth and reduce it in the pan to make a really, really nice, delicious sauce gravy for your steak. You can also go to frank to check out all of my other businesses, guys. I'm always wearing the, you know, Wi-Fi shielding clothing. We got our Wi-Fi shielding hat on right now, but uh, there's a lot of creative products and ideas that you can explore on frank As always, guys, please drop a like on the video, leave a comment down below, subscribe so that YouTube can unsubscribe you next week. And be sure to check that notification bell so they don't notify you of my videos. Thanks again for joining, guys, and I'll see you soon.